Okay, so today I, I took a look at the wall. Um, so basically, um, you there's a, you're sucked into a pinball game, and um, you have to guide this ball by by shooting it with these laser lasers to different colours and um, different things happen to it depending on what colour it is. Um, and uh, as you can see. Uh, they come in the video as well, and um, there's also blocks to zap, and no matter what colour it is, it won't be able to pass through them, but you can break them with your, like, um, any other zapper kind of looking thing, um, and it is very simple, I, and I do, I do like all the neon stuff, um, it is bright and colourful, and if you don't like those kind of games, then uh, I wouldn't suggest getting it, but, um, yeah. It was quite fun, um, it, it's also one of the few few games that actually has gyro controls. And this isn't even like a AAA developer, this is just like a indie game with gyro controls, which I was actually quite surprised um, that uh, such an indie game existed. Um, so yeah, there's that. Um, and the gyro controls work really well. Um, I, I was using the gyro controls the entire time recording this uh, video, and it's not a very long video because, again, it is quite a simple game, so it doesn't need, uh, um, you know, a half hour long video um, explaining the ins and outs of Neon Wall. Um, but what I will say is, well, I'll quickly wrap up here because. Yeah, like I said, it's very simple. Just shoot the ball, go through the course. I will say, if you're into like the kind of mind-bending like puzzle games um, that keeps you on your toes, then yeah, I definitely suggest this. Um, and the gyro controls are optional, so if you don't like them, don't turn them on. Um, and yeah, I definitely uh, like say this is a game worth picking up. Um, because it it was um, quite uh, fun just playing through. I did die a couple of times, as you can see, because I'm not too good at um, puzzle type games. But yeah, um, as you can see here, because I was using gyro controls, I had to um, point the Wii um, Joy Cons at the Switch and press all the D pad buttons and all of the uh, all and A X Y and D a B. Sorry. Um. Which I could have done, like, what I could have just done is, like, press A and, um, like, yeah, well, any of A, X, Y, and B, and any of the, um, D pad. But it's not the end of the world. Um, and this really lends itself well to DLC with, like, new courses and maybe new modes. I haven't even checked if there's any other modes, but. Um, yeah, it, could, it does lend itself well to DLC. Um, yeah. Um, other than that, um, there's not really much to talk about. Um, you know, it's a basic fun puzzle game. What kind of puzzle? Eh, whatever you want to call it. it. It's fun. Definitely suggest picking it up um, if it looks fun to you. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.